Welcome to the Remark Software YouTube channel. With this video, we will demonstrate how you can use Microsoft Word's mail merge functionality to preprint known data onto your Remark Office OMR forms. Remark Office OMR is a plain paper data collection solution that allows you to design your forms in any word processor or survey design package. While you are welcome to use any program you feel comfortable with, Microsoft Word tends to be the most popular option amongst Remark Office OMR customers. Microsoft Word is an easy to use tool even for those who are new to designing Remark Office OMR forms. One of the great features available in Microsoft Word is the ability to set up a mail merge, which is often used for bulk mailings. This functionality allows you to streamline the process of preprinting known data in barcode and or optical character recognition fields. For example, you may be conducting a course evaluation and wish to print the course details directly on the form. This way, students do not have to know this information before completing the evaluation, but you will still have the data on hand for analysis purposes. Other examples of preprinted data include, but are not limited to, location where the form is being completed, dates, test information, unique identifiers, etc. Please note that Mail Merge is a feature of Microsoft Word and not Remark Office OMR. The Remark Office OMR software has the ability to capture the data that is pre-printed from using a Mail Merge so long as these regions meet our form design best practices. Any questions regarding the use of the Mail Merge feature should be directed to Microsoft's support team. In order to successfully execute a Mail Merge, you will need to have a database file set up. This file should contain all of the information you wish to merge into your document. The sample we will be using in this demonstration is an Excel file that contains the professor and course information. We will see this file again a little later in the presentation. Now I will demonstrate how to set up a mail merge for a Remark Office OMR form. The Remark Office OMR sample form we will be using for this demonstration is a course evaluation. This is a popular use case for using a mail merge. For demonstration purposes, the course and professor details have been left blank. We will fill these fields in using Microsoft Word's mail merge feature. To initiate the mail merge setup, you must click the Mailings tab. From here, select the option to start mail merge and select Step-by-Step -step Mail Merge Wizard. The mail merge wizard will open and prompt you to select items such as the type of document you wish to work with, whether you want to use the document currently open, and even select the recipient list, which is the file that Microsoft Word will pull from to print our course and professor information. In this example, we will be connecting to an Excel file that contains each professor's name as well as the course name. Let's take a quick look at that file to see what we are working with. As you can see, the professor and course names appear in separate columns. We will start by merging the course name into our evaluation in a barcode format, as this is the first item that appears on our evaluation. Then we will use Optical Character Recognition, or OCR, to merge the professor names. Going back to our Word document, we can now begin to insert the various fields from our Excel file. First, we need to ensure that our cursor is placed where we want the course name to appear. Once the cursor is set, select the option to Insert Merge Field, and select course from the options available. This will automatically insert a placeholder for this information. After the merge field is inserted, we will need to format this area to be printed in the 3 of 9 barcode font. To do so, we must first place an asterisk on the outside of the mail merge field brackets. Once you have added the asterisk, you will then need to highlight this area and change the font to the barcode 3 of 9 font that installed automatically with Remark Office OMR. Ensure that the font size is at least 26 points in height and that the font is not bolded. If you do not have Remark Office OMR installed, you can download the font from the Remark software website. You will notice some spaces in the barcode, but these will disappear when we complete the merge. Now we want to repeat these steps to insert the professor name using OCR instead of a barcode. Simply place your cursor where you want the professor name to appear. Select Insert Merge Field and Professor from the options available. Once completed, you will have a placeholder for the professor name. Like with the barcode, we will need to ensure that our OCR region is optimized for scanning with Remark Office OMR. 
Whenever using an OCR region, you will need to use a standard font such as Arial or Times New Roman. Your font size should be at least 14. OCR regions should never be bolded or italicized. Once you have adjusted the font style and size, you may proceed. At this point, we can return to the Mailings tab and select the option to Finish and Merge. This will prompt you to select one of three additional options. We recommend choosing Edit Individual Documents. This option will open a new Word document containing all of the merged information. As we can see here, there is a form for each course and professor based on the Excel file we use to set up our mail merge. When scanning these into Remark Office OMR, the software will automatically read the information that was pre-printed within the barcode and OCR regions. The human eye is unable to read the barcode font. In order to see the information within, we recommend printing this information in a small font below the barcode as you see here. This can be done using the Merge feature, but formatting the font so that it is printed in a size that will not interfere with Remark Office OMR's ability to capture the information hidden within the barcode. Printing the text below the barcode allows you to easily review the details within and quickly identify any issues that may have occurred during the mail merge. It is best to review your merge data prior to printing. Thank you for taking the time to watch this tutorial on using Microsoft Word's mail merge functionality. For more information, please contact the Remark sales team or visit our website to sign up to receive the latest news and updates from the Remark products group. Thank you for your interest in the Remark software.